Welcome to TN Inspire at TLCC 2016. My name is Meredith, and I am, among other things, the database manager for Writers Theatre. Now, art and metamorphosis is as old as at least the Greeks. This is my story of art and metamorphosis. And it starts once upon a time in the early days of my Tessitura experience. I once spent three hours trying to figure out how to change the text and URL of a single button in Tinu. <laughs> that button. <laughs> Why? Why would any sane, rational person spend three hours trying to change the text of a single button? The answer is actually quite simple. The art. The theater. Because I know from personal experience about the incredible, transformative, transcendental nature of art. Art has the power to make you different to fundamentally change who you are and what you're about, and all for the better. Now for me, that experience happened in September of 2013. The Old Man and the Old Moon by Pigpen Theater Company at Writer's Theater. I was the box office manager at the time. All full-time staff are required to attend Final Dress. I walked in, sat in the worst seat in the house, and prepared to assess sight lines, temperature, volume, all the usual patron complaints. That's not what happened. I was, from the first moment, the first song completely captivated. I have never been so enraptured, so immersed in a production. For the next hour and 40 minutes, I was not sitting in our tiny 108-seat thrust in Glencoe, Illinois. I was on an epic sea voyage, complete with giant fish and a leaky moon. I then proceeded to see that production 16 more times. <laughs> Later, when Pigpen left Riders and took the old man and the old moon to other places, I bought a plane ticket and I followed. <laughs> I have since seen that show in three more productions. Uh, they were in Williamstown, New York, and Boston. You could say I'm a fan. <laughs> and the reason is not just because this is a beautiful piece of theater, uh, but because it is my metamorphosis. There is a Meredith before the old man in the old moon, and there is a Meredith after. It gave me courage, the courage to travel all over the country, and the courage to stand here and tell you what is a very personal story. It taught me things. It taught me that you cannot watch someone else rise to the challenge of answering their vocation and stay complacent yourself. It taught me how much story really matters. But most importantly, it made me promise myself that I would never again walk away from something that mattered to me because of fear. Now, I can never say thank you enough to Pigpen Theater Company. Those seven men changed my life. And they changed it just by doing theater. Now, I'm willing to bet that most of you in this room know what I'm talking about. I'm betting that you have had that intimate experience with transcendental, transformative art. Now, your story may not be theater. It may be that particular painting in that particular museum. It may be the first time you heard one of the great symphonies live. Or maybe it was that family trip to the Nutcracker over the holidays. If you don't know what I'm talking about, then whether as a patron or a staff member, stay with the arts. And I promise you will know art and metamorphosis. 
That is my contact information. If anybody else would like to share their stories, I'd love to hear them. I've also included the Pigpen Theater Company website if anybody's interested. Thank you.